I'm not quite sure what to expect. Um, I've never held um, a, a large bird before. I think the largest birds I've ever had anything to do with are budgies. Um, so I don't really know what to expect. I'm not too worried about the talons. I'm assuming that I'll be given a large glove with plenty of protection from talons. Um, just worried a bit about the beaks. Uh, we offer falconry experiences for people with disabilities um, not that dissimilar to able-bodied people. We'd we'll ask them their preferences, we'll sit and have a cup of coffee and I'll get an, an idea of what they're really genuinely interested in because it's very much a hands-on experience. And how heavy is she? She's two pounds two. So that's incredible. Just can not, not much it. heavier than a bag of sugar. Yeah. But if you walked around yeah. with a bag of sugar sticking out like that for any length of time, it's quite heavy. But that's amazing that I can hold her, to be honest. Good girl. Good girl. Obviously, somebody with a, a visual impairment, um, they will get most benefit from actually touching the bird. Um, obviously, the soft feathers of the bird, um, the silent flight, and also by handling the bird, um, they will get some idea of the weight and the size of the bird for something that maybe they haven't seen before. This is lovely. It was absolutely wonderful. Um, didn't realise the different textures of the feathers, so that was really interesting. After I'd um, held the first one, I wasn't at all nervous. They all seemed to be quite um, calm, and Steve was brilliant. It was just lovely to feel the weight of the birds on your hand. And when they land, you expect your hand to be pushed down, but it, they just land so light on your hands and, and it was just absolutely wonderful. <laughs>